Hey you guys, what's up? Welcome back to Yen Truck Gaming. Thank you guys for stopping by. I appreciate it. I hope you're having a great day. As we're getting started here, just a quick reminder for you guys to please like the video, make sure you leave me a comment, and definitely subscribe if you want to see more. But either way, I hope you guys enjoy this episode of Portal Revolution. All right, so let's do a new game. Chapter one, the human resource. All right, let's, uh, let's play. I like the loading screen, that's pretty cool. Oh yes. So we're moving. Hang on. Let me look at the settings. Turn the sensitivity down a little bit. Volume, let's turn the music down a little bit. Turn the master volume down a little bit. Um, do we want dialogue only or full captions? Let's do full captions. Video full screen, looks good, looks good. All right, looks good. Let's keep going. So I can't get up or move or anything yet. Right now we're just moving. <laughs> going up now. So at least we're going in a different direction. test subject you have been in suspension for 72 days that's it the aperture science computer aided enrichment center congratulates you on your 36 year sleep <laughs> anniversary thanks you have been selected as a potential candidate for our human emergency response team please review the agreement provided on the nearby monitor okay oh boy it moves fast what's this all right, um, we got a microwave. To be accepted into the human emergency response team, you will now participate in an advanced difficulty testing track where your problem solving skills, athleticism, and response to increasingly hazardous conditions will be evaluated. Please press the button to accept the terms. Okay, what could go wrong? Thank you for volunteering. You're welcome. The door will open in three, two, one. It's a little bit of screen tearing. Yeah, I don't know what I can do about the the screen tearing there. All right, right off the rip, here we go. Don't have a portal gun yet. Level zero. So this is a fan-made game from what I understand. And so far it's spot on, well done. Test subjects may experience symptoms of mental defects after long-term chemically induced hibernation. You will now participate in a brain damage evaluation survey to determine just how damaged your brain is. Okay. If you believe your brain is sufficiently operational, press the button in front of you and continue the test. Yeah, I'm Very good. good. Please walk through the portal and continue testing. Your sure self-reported status is more than sufficient for testing. Whoops. Okay, so it's pretty sensitive. All right. Nice. 
So pretty familiar so far. Um, I have to get in there and push that button. So you want me to take this one first? I can't sprint. Go in here. And we can push the button. And it reactivates up there. Okay, nice. Please be advised that noticeable damage to eyesight is not part of any test protocols, but it's an unintended side effect of the Aperture Science Material Emancipation Grill, which in semi-rare cases may emancipate some of the light-sensing rods and cones inside your head. Thank you. All right, I see my portal gun down here, so let's go get that. Maybe. Um, which way do I need to go? I should have just stayed in there. I'm gonna have to go back around again. Okay. Sorry, I'm trying to get my options uh, settled, settled here. So on the... where was that game? Where's the subtitles? I don't, I don't want, I don't want it to say portal opening, portal closing every time. So let's just do dialogue only. And there we go. Okay. Okay. Boom. You are now in possession of the Aperture Science handheld portal device. Yeah, I am. As a candidate for the Human Emergency Response Team, you are expected to adapt to all dangerous situations, and as such, will not be informed about the device's safety hazards. Okay, but now where do you want me to go? Um, up here? Yep, there we go. Alright, nice. I love this game. Portal 1 was really good. Portal 2, I feel like, was a little bit better. I feel like they had a little bit bigger budget for that one, maybe. <laughs> Your performance in the next test chamber will be timed to measure puzzle solving and execution speed during extreme wind and weather conditions. In the rare case that wind and weather conditions appear to be ordinary, please stay idle in the entrance foyer until the desired conditions are met. to go. Lots of blocks. I need to get my block in here. Move on. Yikes. Uh, what do you want me to do here? All right, let's just go up first and see what they want. Um, 
There's a block. Okay. Well, let's go here. Get this guy on here. You're gonna have to stay on there, though. There you go. And then, I think we just wanna go up here, right? Uh, oh, I need another one. Wait, if I push this again, is it gonna remove the first one? Uh, yes it is. But... Wait, where was the other one at? Up top? Is that okay? Can I take this block now? And just go this way? Or did it close out my... Okay, I thought it was going to close my portal if I did that. And stop! <laughs> Congratulations, test subject number one. You have set the world record for this exercise. And now officially hold first and last place on the leaderboard. <laughs> nice. Okay, what do we have here? You tell me. All right, looks like we're gonna have some lasers. The next test may contain concentrated amounts of electromagnetic radiation that may be harmful to the retinas of some humans. <laughs> Enrichment Center recommends to solve this test with closed eyes, as health insurance will not be provided for this specific exercise. In case the light sensing rods and cones of your eyes have previously been emancipated by an emancipation grill, feel free to ignore the prior warning. Okay. Um, there should be a block somewhere though, right? Yeah. Which block I want this to go through, though. Okay, that's gonna hold the door open. But, uh, we ain't done yet, though. I come this way. Let me. I don't think this goes through. Does it? Wait, what? Can I go through? I cannot. Can I fire through when it's red? I know it's blocked otherwise, but can I fire through when it's red? No. Kills you. I didn't realize. Mm hmm. 
All right. Can I get another one? I can't go that way. I mean, I can pick it up, but it's not going to do me any good in there. It's level four and I'm already lost. Somebody broke that. All right. Um, so this goes to what? This just blocks off this wall. But why do I need to block off the wall? I don't. I just need... I just need this, but when I go through... Okay. Because when I go through, then my... Portal goes away. Okay. Okay, hang on. All right, that'll do it. I'm not sure if that's what I was supposed to do, but you have completed the test. If we you did. have not done so already, you are permitted to open your eyes. <laughs> Thank you. Before starting with the next test chamber, we would like to remind you that, so far, no experiment has yet unproven whether or not weighted storage cubes are not incapable of not feeling pain when being emancipated. Where did it go? Um, where did that block go? Let me see. Oh, right beside me. Okay. Let me come here. Um, no, let me go back out here. Okay. Now, let's do this. Okay, and that probably should have opened the door. Wait, that's another one over there. Uh, that's okay, right? Okay, and then it needs to go in here.
But how do I get my block back? Get a new one. Yeah. Okay. All right. Whoa. Okay. So we've got to stick this one on here. Where's my uh, yellow portal? Do the old switcheroo. Brilliant! Well done, candidate. You have successfully solved five test chambers. To ensure a high quality of human resources, the following test chambers may include elements of danger. Extra caution is advised. Good luck. Thank you. I always like those. Those are good. Center, I wish to apologize about the current state of our testing facility. Due to technical difficulties, we are unable to provide an experience of suitable quality at this time. Uh. Okay. Alright, so that's going to turn on the light. I have to somehow get that cube. Or that cube. Let's see what's over here. Okay, it's timed. you out. How barbaric. Okay, so it is now traveling back and forth. So I guess first thing I need to do is not that. Um, so where did it go?
There we go. That's the first. So I can put that on there. So then if I do it again, is it going to give me another one? Nope, it just takes away the first one. Okay, well, when I can do this, and then what's this one? Okay, um... Well, did it wrong. Try that again. Okay. Got it. There we go. How am I going to get that in there? I don't even know where the laser is. Can I do the switcheroo again? Let's see what happens when I do this. Okay, there's my laser. Is this going to go through the wall though? Yep, yeah, sure is. Alright. There we go. Stuck on the wall. Double Not staircase. Bad. something in here? Wait. This is just a room? Nice. Nice. Oh, okay. Let's see here. Remember, robots don't sleep. They can test and do your job. Volunteer for testing today. Okay. Well, I've got a nice little portal in there for probably no reason. This is like um, a little little maze back here. Okay, what's back here? Oh, that's the exit. Hang on. I didn't go this way. Let me see what's up here. It's strange that they have these extra rooms up here if they're just going to pass me on to the next level. See, look at that. Hmm. That's interesting. All right. Just a little back and forth there. Not a bad start. So far, I'm loving it, loving it. Looks good. If you enjoyed the video, please like the video. If you want to see more content like this, feel free to subscribe and be sure to turn on notifications so you never miss an upload. As always, thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.